Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm back with a Target fall try on haul. So many requests for this try on haul and I am so excited to share it with you guys today. Lots of really cute fall looks, lots of casual and dressy and everything kind of in between. So I have a variety of a lot of different outfits. I'll have it of course all linked below for you guys in case you wanna check it out. And if you are new here, welcome. My name is Karen and I'd love for you to join us on all things girly, feminine, lots of fashion, beauty, and lifestyle here on my channel. All right, so I have a lot of good looks to share with you guys. So I'm just gonna get started with this first dress. All right, we are starting off with this beautiful fall floral dress. This is perfect for transitioning into fall time or if it's just warm pretty much all throughout fall where you live. This is the perfect way to dress for fall because it's all the fall color palette happening throughout but if it's too warm to wear a sweater and jeans that day i think this is such a cute option um i am 5'7 for reference i'd say the length is a tiny bit shorter on me but i just paired it with some booty you could even do a short pair of booties i shared these in my fall shoe guide in case you guys missed it and i will link it below if you want to check out that video where i share like all my favorite fall shoes from sneakers to flats to mules everything um but anyways back to this dress i love it too because it's two dresses in one it totally has the option to wear off the shoulder too so you guys have to let me know do we like off the shoulder or on the shoulder for this dress better i'm actually feeling like i like on the shoulder better i don't know i kind of just like the way the neckline is and then the sleeves i like it better on the shoulder i do have it paired with this neutral bag that i absolutely love it is just such a stunning stunning bag especially for fall i feel like it's gonna go with so so much and then i also will show you guys my jewelry i just got this necklace in it has a butterfly on it i just love a butterfly charm and then these are the bracelets that i have on so i'll have them all linked the middle one is my initial i don't know if you guys can see the charm on it because it's like flipping around but it's an initial bracelet the other one's a heart and then these like this pink beaded one okay i am totally loving this next outfit it is so different this is actually a really good outfit if you're a teacher um this would be a really good workwear outfit like if i was a teacher i would totally wear this outfit i just love these corduroy pants and this really cozy chenille sweater just depending on your um, place of work whatever your dress code is this may work for work or you could even mix and match these pieces and wear this sweater with jeans for an everyday casual look i just think this is such a cute and cozy sweater Sweater. it has the mock neck detail it's chenille so it's very plush and soft and i love the length on this you could totally even do spanx full leather leggings with this um it has the v cut out on the side which is really flattering and like i said in the back it just covers you so it's really nice and then these pants right here these are the corduroy pants that are by the brand universal thread i feel like you would totally see something like these pants in madewell so it's definitely a nice um quality brand from target it has a little bit of stretch to them which is really nice but i would say for sizing i would definitely say to size up one size from your regular and i think then they fit perfectly because i feel like they're just like running small if i got my regular size they'd be a little tight in the knees and then i of course just paired it with these mules that look like they're gucci but they're not and these are also super super comfy if you have to be on your feet all day and you will still want to look chic these are amazing. If you can't tell, I love this scarf so much. I kind of just threw it on over my shoulders, but you could just see also how the plaid kind of breaks everything up even more. I definitely love this scarf. Um, it is just so cute. And I love it with this outfit. It actually works so perfectly. Like the tones in the um, plaid are like matching perfectly with these pants, but these pants do come in a couple other colors as well. Okay, how cute is this coat? I can't believe how cute some of the coats are at Target. This one kind of reminds me of a coat that I had from Abercrombie like two years ago, I think. It was like the utility park that it was called. And also reminds me of one I also have had from H&M. So this is kind of like reminding me of that same silhouette, same idea. Um, it's like a military kind of parka, but I wouldn't say it's as thick and plush as maybe the Abercrombie one I had. It's definitely though a little bit thicker than I thought it was gonna be. It does have this like Sherpa lining throughout all the way even in the back, but it is not carried throughout the sleeve. So it's only in the body of the jacket. It also came a little bit boxier. I cinched in 
the little drawstring detail here to give it some more shape because when it first came in it was just like boxy i think it was a little too overpowering so just cinch it in if you want a little bit more shape to the coat has the pockets they're not lined or anything um they're just you know the regular fabric um but overall if you want like a like a lighter to medium weight jacket for fall you've been going into winter this is a really nice option it's just so cute also has the hood detail with the fuzzy lining inside and the hood is detachable has a zipper all throughout the hood so that's a nice option as well if you don't want the hood on it um but overall i think it's just such a chic jacket very pretty color i love it paired with these pants and this sweater i feel like it just goes together very nicely it blends really nice and um, it buttons up and zips up as well really cozy and cute so i'd say it runs true to size um you could wear it boxier or i like the option that you could pull in the drawstring to give you a little bit more shape okay i am obsessed with this next dress i actually already wore it out and it is just so darling and pretty again another beautiful fall floral dress i did size up in this one because i just wanted to see for length if it would be a little bit better knowing like the other one it was a little gonna be a tad bit shorter on me so i do like the length of this one on with the small on me like i said i'm five seven um but otherwise i mean i probably could have gotten away with an extra small i think this one may also be running a little bit longer than the other one i showed you guys um but look at this floral up close it is just so beautiful i love the burgundy you guys have to let me know do we like the first floral dress or do we like the burgundy and pink you guys have to vote below and i love that it has like the tiered detailing i feel like it's a very flattering fit very flowy and um, i've just paired it with sneakers actually i think the sneakers just kind of dress it down make it comfy and cute even if you're just out running errands or something i think this is a cute outfit idea um even to go to lunch these sneakers are incredibly comfortable i can't even say enough great things about them and then i would do of course this bag again loving it so much and then my pearl Band. otherwise i'd say the dress runs the true to size but if you want a tad longer then you could probably get away with sizing up one but i just absolutely adore it up next i want to show you guys a really good basic sweater my first thought is of course just to wear it with jeans i always love a good sweater and jean combination but i wanted to show you guys just something a little bit different in case you're looking to just switch it up though so of course you could so you could so you definitely could just like wear your favorite jeans and then pair it with this sweater it goes longer in the back it's a little bit shorter in the front i'll untuck it in a second so you guys can see um but i just paired it with this uh, vegan suede mini skirt i just ordered it in brown i'm waiting for it to come in and i'm really excited about it because it is such a cute skirt and i have these like brown western inspired booties they're walmart so i just think they're really darling and great if you want to look a little bit trendier but don't want to spend a ton of money on a trendy boot sweater i'd say it runs true to size it is like maybe as you could see one inch longer in the back than it is the front has this like front seam is really pretty with the drop shoulder detail so a little bit slouchier and really like fuzzy it's a lighter to medium weight and i think it is really darling for fall if you are looking for a really comfy and soft material dress this is the perfect one for fall it's three quarter sleeves i like switching up with this gray color actually it's like a slight gray very soft and cozy as i said the material is so nice it's more like that gauzy look to it but it's a nice thicker material it flows really nicely but not too oversized again it's hitting me at a pretty decent length i feel like and then i just pair it with some booties again and my bag and this like blush pink hat i got this last year i'll see if they have it this year again um from nordstrom i also thought i'd show you guys you could totally unbutton the sleeve and wear it long sleeve for that option as well if it's like chillier in the morning you could have that that way and then during the day if you're getting warmer you could totally just roll up the sleeves which is really nice um it just will have that little button detail there i also want to show you guys what it looks like with a scarf as it's just a different styling option if you want to layer it up even more you could even do a cute moto jacket on top of this as well but i just love this plaid scarf this plaid scarf that i just got um has like gray in it camo rosy pinks and like ivory so it really goes with any color i love that it has the gray in it 
so that it goes well with this and it's just not like a totally like warm tone scarf so it has all the different neutral tones to it which is why i love it so much it is so cozy and soft this also does come in solid colors as well so i will definitely link it below for you guys in case you want to style this outfit this way but i also just in general though want to show you what a scarf overall looks like with the dress up next is a really cute smocked dress i have to say i love the silhouette of this one but I'm not too sure if I absolutely love like the coloring in it. I'm not used to like wearing these like darker florals like this. It's a black background with like autumnal colors. So I don't know, you guys have to let me know. Should I keep or return this one? I love like the smocked detail at the top and then it's just flowy like a baby doll dress and it has the puffy sleeves. And it, this length of this dress is actually pretty long compared to the other ones I tried on. It's probably the longest of them all so it is really cute and festive for fall time that is for sure i just don't know now because i just love the silhouette of this dress it's just so beautiful and i don't know if i should just try something different i don't know you guys let me know below what i should do okay this next sweater dress is everything i just love a good sweater dress i am very picky with the fit i always feel like some sweater dresses could be very clingy this is such a good one and such a good price point and the quality of the fabric too is really nice i just love how it just drapes over my body perfect neutral has a puff sleeve so it adds a little bit of a statement and makes it more chic with the puff sleeve and i just paired it with a crossbody bag i will try to see if i can find these like pre-loved i also just paired it with these tall booties you could even just do like a short um heeled booty would be good too or even a flat booty you could do a lot of different shoes with this dress you don't necessarily have to wear these but i just love these so so much um and then i just paired it with one of my favorite hats if you guys have been on my channel for some time i've been wearing these baker boy hats a lot for fall okay this next coat was kind of a fail i feel like i just think it is very unflattering uh especially i think it's deceiving because of how puffy it looks i just think it is way too puffy for just like how little it like i feel like it's like insulating so um i definitely don't love this coat um i just feel like it's unflattering it's not that warm for how much like puffiness the jacket has i had high hopes for this it's just not working and i don't and when you belt it it even I don't know, I just don't love it. So I'll show you guys the sweater underneath. Okay, this is what the sweater looks like. It's a dusty rose and um, white striped sweater. It has that textured material to it. It's not quite as soft as the solid white one I showed you guys. It kind of looks a little bit similar, but it's not exactly um, the same. It has like a more open V-neck, so you could totally like wear it off one shoulder if you wanted to, but I did a front tuck and it's pretty slouchy. I'll untuck it so you guys could see. This is what it looks like, but I just paired it with these jeans from Abercrombie. I'll have them linked below for you guys. They're just like a straight leg, and then I paired it with these bow flats, which I am like adoring so much. I just love these like little bow mules. Okay, up next we have this really darling coat. I'd say the color is more like a mix between raspberry and rose. Um, definitely has a little bit more of like a hint of like a purpley tone, which is why I think it's a little bit more like raspberry, but it's kind of like the silhouette of a duffel coat, but not exactly. It doesn't have like the toggles or anything on it, but it is really, really cute. I think it's running like a little bit um, oversized. So if you're kind of like in between and not sure about sizing, then I would definitely size down one from your regular, but otherwise I I'm wearing my regular size i love how it fits i think it's just a really nice classic option but kind of dresses up your outfit a little bit um i just have it paired with this leopard sweater also from target and same jeans as before and these like neutral mules but i just want to show you guys this sweater kind of has the same concept as the other ones a little longer in the back this is like not super soft but it has like that textured material to it it's nice and like a little bit lighter weight depending on what the weather is that day i think this is a really cute option and leopard is just so fun but this is a little bit more like toned down and you could do like a cute necklace stack with this like v it's like a softened v neckline nothing like too harsh okay up next how cute is this super feminine short sleeve blouse i love all the ruffle of detailing just cascading throughout and i have it just tucked into these straight leg jeans again um this is also another universal thread piece so i feel like again very like made well vibe again and it's just so pretty but overall i'd say this top fits true to size and i have it paired with these brown mules which are the same as the croc ones i showed you guys earlier and then for the jeans i'd say if you're in between with these abercrombie jeans to size up otherwise true to size 
But yeah, this is such a really cute, like feminine fall top. Up next is a really casual and cozy sweatshirt. It has a feminine detail though with the lace detail on the shoulder, which I think is a really pretty addition. It's nice and long. You can wear it with your comfy leggings if you wanted to or jeans. And then I just did these slip on sneakers that I got in. I think they're just like really comfy. And I love a good slip on option if you're just like on the go and wanna just slip into them really quickly. I'd say this sweatshirt though fits true to size. It's a really nice fit. I love that it goes like even longer in the back. It's just really cozy and this material is so soft. So that is it for my Target fall try on haul. If you guys enjoyed it, give this video a thumbs up and let me know your favorite down below. I always love hearing from you guys and hearing your favorites. And of course, if you wanna check anything out, I'll have all the sizing details below as well as the links to everything in the description box. And that's gonna be it for today's video. Consider hitting subscribe before you head out of this video if you're new. I love to have you guys join in on my channel and I will see you all in my next video very soon. Love you guys. Bye.